Welcome to LMC. Today we're taking a look at this Peugeot 5008 Blue HDI GT line. It's got a two litre diesel engine with an automatic gearbox and it's on 37,233 miles. Now this spacious seven seater is finished off nicely in this glossy pearl white colour with a blacked out roof and chrome features surrounding the windows and on the bottom of the doors. Blacked out mirror caps and chrome roof bars. Split tone alloy wheels with a polished face and GT line badging all over the car. Daytime running lights and chrome features on the front grille and splitter. You've also got front parking sensors all the way around. Tinted glass on the side and rear. Nice modern looking rear lights. And a lip spoiler on the boot lid, colour matching the roof nicely. Rear parking sensors and chrome exhaust tips. And a chrome plate on the top of the bumper to protect it when loading and unloading the boot. Now, talking about boot space, as you can see at the moment, we've got one of the seats up. Now this can sit up to seven people, but as you can see, there's a nice advantage to having the rear seats folded down. And you've got a nice spacious boot, which is nicely lit as well. In terms of interior, all blacked out with plenty of legroom, climate controls controlled by the rear as well. 12 volt socket and storage nets. You've got these trays that fold down for your rear passengers. Half leather seating with cloth sensors, nice cloth and leather headrests. You've got cream stitching matching the exterior color of the car. Then up front, you've got your window controls on the door card with your automatic lighting on the left stick. You've got a nice clear instrument cluster with steering wheel controls as well as paddle shifters on either side. And in the centre is a screen which features maps and navigation as well as radio. You've also got Bluetooth and USB connection for music as well as Bluetooth for your phone. And then USB connection for Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And if I put the car into reverse, you see it brings up a nicely reversing camera and your sensors on the front and rear of the vehicle. Below this, you've got the controls to bring up your menus on the screen. You've also got your windscreen defrost, nice ambient lighting with a 12 volt socket and USB point, and plenty of storage going all the way back next to the electronic cam brake and sport button. You've also got cup holders and a nicely lit center console storage compartment right underneath your arm. So if you'd like any more information, please visit our website and thank you very much for watching.